Hello everyone. The sub subject of this research is determinants of price discovery on Bitcoin, evidence from spot and futures market. We have five members in this group, respectively Supervisor Dr. Lian Yumin and Zhong Yuzhi, Zheng Qihong, Lin Shixun, and Yang Jianqi. And I am Lin Shixun, the speaker of this film. In this film, we will cover the background of Bitcoin, the purpose of the research, the methodology of analysis, and the results of this research. Ever since the emergence of subprime mortgage crisis of 2008, many countries started to devalue their uh, currencies, making their country more beneficial to export. Many investors suffer a great loss. Investors thus have been losing confidence on central banks and currencies. Under such circumstances, the concept of uh, currency decentralization emerged. The cryptocurrency has, uh, was born right after. It will not be linked to any currencies of various countries, nor would it be interfered by uh, government policy. Along with the rapid growth of Bitcoin, the demand of Bitcoin has increased drastically. The corresponding derivatives financial products has emerged as well. At the end of last year, Bitcoin futures has been listed on CBOE and CME. This allows investors to have more investment channels of Bitcoins and offer few features of price discovery on Bitcoin. On the other hand, men, in the March of this year, the G20 13th Summit proposed the concept of cryptocurrency is a uh, digital asset. Hence, we decided to use uh, the CAPM model to conduct a research and analysis on the Bitcoin market. Since the white price fluctuation happened in the spot market of Bitcoin. Bitcoin futures has been issued. The rapid development of blockchain brings cryptocurrencies launched one after the other, and its high return on investment rate attract investors all around the world. This situation shows that the importance of risk management. Therefore, we want to provide a, a viable direction for those who want to invest in Bitcoin and Bitcoin futures. Our methodology is to use CAPM models because the correlation between Bitcoin spot, excess return and market excess return can be provided by CAPM model to introduce the impact of multi-factors on Bitcoin spot. We extend the classical model in, uh, to incorporate the influence of spot market and dummy variables. We respectively test with three CAPM models. The first one, we include cryptocurrency index, which we uh, will call it CRIX, as the return of benchmark. The second one, we add NASDAQ 100 index as our extended val variable. And the third model, we add uh, dummy variables. In addition, the regression model of on Bitcoin futures, we also test with three CAPM models. The first one, we include the total return of C SPG SCI as the return of benchmark. The second one, we add NASDAQ 100 index and Bitcoin cash as our extended variables. And the third model, we add dummy variables. And this part states empirical results of original CAPM and multi-factor CAPM to Bitcoin spot market and Bitcoin futures market. The result of original CAPM in Bitcoin spot market revealed that there is a significant positive correlation between Crick's market excess returns and Bitcoin expected return. Where market index of cryptocurrency rise Bitcoin spot market returns goes up, and vice versa. The systematic risk significantly 
exist, but that can be uh, considered as a hedge because the price of Bitcoin meet randomness and it's difficult to predict future prices of Bitcoin through the historical data to proceed arbitrage. In a multi-factor CAPM of Bitcoin spot market, the empirical results match the original CAPM model. Incorporate the information factor as dummy variables. Use information factor as the date of news event that the price fluctuation of the return of Bitcoin spot market is over 5%. The results provide a significant relationship between the good and bad information and Bitcoin spot market. And the beta coefficient of good information is positive. The beta coefficient of bad information is negative. This results match the economic uh, intuition. Combines the results above in the final multi-factor CAPM model of spot market. The most influential factor is the systematic risk. And then good information and bad in information and NASDAQ 100 index is not significant. The results of our original CAPM in Bitcoin futures market reveal that there is significant positive correlation between total return of SPG SCI market excess returns and Bitcoin futures expected return. When market index of total return of SPG SCI rises, Bitcoin futures market returns goes up. When the market index falls, Bitcoin spot market returns goes down. The systematic risk significantly exists, but that can be considered as a hedge as well. Bitcoin futures market return rises when returns of Bitcoin cash goes up, and vice versa. Explain that Bitcoin cash can be uh, consider, consider as a hedge too, and it has similar influence, influence to Bitcoin futures market expected return. The return of Bitcoin futures market rise when the good information occurred, and the return decline when bad information occurred. The results also match in economic intuition. We incorporate NASDAQ uh, index Bitcoin Cash and market information can let the explanatory power increase a lot. And especially the, influ the influence of the market information shows its extremely high value to reference. <coughs> so uh, the conclusion is that our research use original CAPM and multi-factor CAPM model to provide insight in, into how market excess returns influence Bitcoin spot and Bitcoin futures market. For detailed analysis, we not only consider the impact of various factors, but also the impact of information asymmetry. The results illustrate that we can't neglect the influence of NASDAQ 100 index, Bitcoin Cash, and the market information to Bitcoin futures, especially the market information. We provide these models to investors as a reference to, me to measure the relationship between Bitcoin and various risks in the market. According to the regression uh, results of spot and futures, the de dependent variable was mainly influenced by market index. For those who want to invest in Bitcoin or Bitcoin futures, our research provides them a viable direction. Uh, 